Hadi. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Hi. Hi, Sylvia. Good morning, Medica. Can you tell me how to pronounce your name, by the way? You just did it. <laughs> oh, I did already did it very well. <laughs> you know, that reminds me about, about the conversation we have like today. About you want to do the best thing, you know. And then, and then you already did you know, something like that. So, so tell me, what are we going to talk about it today, this morning? So this, we're here to invite you to a very special program series with me, an energy pool series, 21 dates with your creativity, with your inner artist. As most of you might know that I'm an artist and I play a lot with my artworks and I talk to them a lot and I have these conversations and corporations and it's I realized it's an area that I would love to share with people and give them tools like especially the energy pulls are really very very dear to my heart so I've been doing it for for years and years and years and created so many things in my life and in my art life that I, yeah, that I would love to invite you to this 21 special dates with your inner artist. I love dates. I really love dates. So um, for people who doesn't know me, uh, I live, I'm based in the Netherlands and Melika and I, we know each other because we both live translated for Access Consciousness and we uh, have met each other like life, our bodies like, you know, hugging and the talking and maybe have some one or two glasses of wine or something different. <laughs> and I remember how we connected is like, um, we are also in an, an, another closed Facebook group. And um, I noticed that I, um, there is something about uh, waking up early in the morning and I get like, ideas etc and then and, and we when we were both in a uh, same closed facebook group i saw a picture of someone and i was like oh this is for melika really 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 you know what i'm going to say you know, well, well said to her like is this something for you and then you were awake and uh you and then they were like we we're chatting and since then almost every single morning there is some creation that talked to me and since then also one of them is with you i mean for you for your class or this class actually how that how it's created so i'm just wondering I, I was wondering like am i the only one early in the morning probably not but what do you do i mean like early in the morning is usually when you have to work if you work outside the house you work for a bus or maybe you have kids you have to bring them to school or whatever and I was like, how do you do that with creation that? So Melika, how do you do that actually, by the way, in the morning with creations? That's a very good question. I actually have a magical book. <laughs> you have a magical have, book? I have a book. It's just on the other side now, so I'm not going to take it here, but it's like a magical mm -hmm. creation book. It says magical mm -hmm. creations on it. And then I'll put all my ideas and visions and projects in there, right? And I'll just put it on top of each page. And then I've read down all the steps I need that re require to be done, like really actively done in this reality. Um, so I get them out. So I get like the exhibitions done. I get uh, classes created and everything is like this creative, interference it's like this creative process that that I'll just put in there and then in the mornings I'll ask I'll ask questions I'll do clearings and I'll ask questions about which one wants to be created which one's got priority which one needs attention and they'll just ping and it's so funny because I have so many businesses and I do so many things people are always like how do you do that like yeah. you're a single mom you have 
like three businesses that are global and you are online and you travel a lot and you do all this stuff. And I'm like, yeah. And they're like, isn't it too much? And I'm like, no. And then I had a look at it, actually really like, how do I create not only in the mornings, but always. And it's this space of asking questions and following the energy, the things that are light. They'll just ping and I'll just do it and be like, oh, this is really light today. So even with my texts, it's like that. I'll just like postpone, postpone. And earlier on, I would have made myself wrong for postponing stuff right? I'd be like, oh, I'm too lazy. I don't like this. Then once I started asking questions, I realized there is a ping and I'll just sit down and start and it'll just be finished as if by magic. And it was like, oh, this is so cool. I'll just make a phone call and be like, and I postponed that one. Maybe you all can refer to this, right? You're like, oh, I don't want to do this. And then there's this one point where you're like, oh, I'll just do it now. And then the person will be there. You'll have a great time. It will be funny. Everything will be sorted in a couple of minutes. And it's like, that was magical. And that's the ping. That's like something people mostly make themselves wrong for, for waiting to the right moment. And what we do with the energy pools is like, we we pull all these creations in and send trickles out to all the moments the people the beings that can contribute so we can create all the things that want to be created by us that will change the world with total ease yeah yeah it's funny you mentioned about taxes because i was postponing my taxes and <laughs> right we were talking about that <laughs> yeah we were talking about it like i don't have time for you right i don't have time and also it was so loud to create you for you like i don't have time you have to do taxes and i was like okay what do i require somebody who's um uh who's you know like contribute to me and, and i found someone who's contribute to me and i did that almost daily and i said for that and then the creation this series like keep talking to me I'm like okay okay you know <laughs> And that is what I, I get that what you were saying about the energy pool. It's like asking like who, what it require, like a, like a date and during a date, you are like looking at it like, hello, what do you need? Do you want coffee? Do you want tea or and what else? And, and, and yeah, it is like a date now. Now I, yeah, I'm, I'm so looking forward for it. But if, you know, like, can you tell us more about you were mentioned about energy pool? Probably we're going to do that. But what else? What what is like pinging? What then? What what's then? So the idea was really like to do the energy pools, and then I realized, and then there is a certain space that is created within that energy pools, right? We we push up the energy, and it's like really every time I do the energy pools, everybody goes out like yeah. And I realized that I would love to gift that space or the, the creations, the ideas, that space of an hour extra after the energy pulse. So we can stay in a Zoom room, we can do some more clearings or whatever is unclear or do some brainstorming. And then everybody works on their projects, works on their ideas, like goes into action. And that is a step most people miss. They will go like, oh, yeah, I'll do it later. And then they will postpone. But in a way of I have to do this and that. And then the books, the songs, the plays, nothing really gets created because we're just like putting it off. And I wanted to gift you that space of an hour daily for 21 days to see where you can get with all your projects like what is really possible like maybe you want to write a book in 21 days maybe you want to do a painting maybe you want to write poems or make create anything whatever it is it might also be classes or other things like everything like everything you create is a creative act and people mostly come to my class and like I'm not creative and I'm like let's see (laughs) and then they will just discover all this creativity in them when we don't have those points of views that we are not creative, that we can't do creative stuff. There is like magic behind that, like behind judgment, there's always magic. So how can we go beyond this 
borders beyond this limitations yeah I'm excited i'm like oh yeah, I me too <laughs> me too and and i'm also like hey we are both like doing that also with, with each other like i think it's almost like every morning that one of us ping each other like hello good morning <laughs> this is popping up etc and so it's it's so fun it's so fun to see uh, when a creation is so loud and also would like to play with us and then suddenly there is there is like magical time available I mean like for me it's like I work also for a boss and I have to sometimes go outside the house and do you know get the office and it's like a travel time and also with the taxes that I have to finish it so uh, but then I remember that I said to you I don't have time or time and then somehow there is some time that is being created. It's like magic and, and then thing and it's been done. Yeah. And what, what for me is really important is like maybe like the time doesn't fit for you. It's like mm -hmm. I, I talked to one of the interested um, persons that uh, mm -hmm. she, she, she asked me, she was like, hey, how is it? Do you have any translation? And yes, we'll translate this. Oh, cool. The... Um, to English and the time like for Americans is like 3 a.m. in the morning so Ooh. you'll just get the recordings and can take your time whenever you want you can mm -hmm. just play the energy pool in your language English or German and then you can give yourself gift yourself that space of creation time and this doesn't mean you have to do something it can also be just like to sit around for an hour and do nothing and be just like I'll in, I want to invite you to also that possibility that you can just choose whatever pops up. And if it's just like taking a time off and be and do nothing, if you want to meditate, meditate. If you want, just take this one hour a day for yourself and your creations and your inner artist to really explode beyond the limitations if you set for yourself. And just imagine, no, get the energy of, what it would be like if you take those 21 days for yourself and your inner artists and your creations just get the energy it's like what could you create what could you have what could you be what could you institute and implement in 21 days wow I, wow i get beyond imagination so wow yeah Wow. I get so excited. Yeah, I, me too. Me too. And it's so funny how it's, you know, like, yeah, how it gets created. It's so yummy. Mm -hmm. So when do we have our first date? The first date is uh, September 11th, actually. We'll start. <laughs> 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 the really nice date where it's like, where do you want to, do you want to, go through your borders, through your limitations and create beyond everything you've created so far. September 11th, it is. It is. <laughs> it's starting off it, like a rocket ship. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And it's in the morning, right? I mean, I mean, in the- uh, In the morning, C time, yeah. like for all the Germans or German speaking people or Europeans is 9 CT, so 9 AM yeah. in the morning. We'll do 21 minutes of energy pulls and then you have the option to additionally book an hour hour in a Zoom room with me where we are in a group and go into this action mode, like really implement everything that comes up. Yeah, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And also know like I know you also like a translator, life translator, but also as an artist. And I didn't know you have way much more businesses there and I mean like I noticed some energy uh, but I didn't know like like knowing as when I see it and I know what I have been seeing is, is your 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 artwork and they're like oh my god it's so amazing and I know you are a single mom I'm like how does she does that <laughs> you know so yeah so it's it's I'm looking forward also to learn from you and also to see how you do it because it's 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 amazing when I tap into the energy. I'm like, wow. <laughs> yeah. 
you'll all get to see it in those 21 dates with me <laughs> and your creations and in our artists yeah. and yeah what is possible beyond your wildest imagination what is yeah, possible no, no. beyond this reality for you and your creations and I love to do stuff by ease so what I thought about was like um there is an artist I really love and um Abramovich her name is Abramovich and what she does is like she always goes into pain like she always goes to that borders where you have so much pain that you create out create yourself and I was always wondering what else is possible I was like hey what would it be like to out create ourselves out of ease out of joy out of glory like have this as your guiding um energies and this is what I want to invite you to. So if you want to yeah. us, start September yeah. 11th. <laughs> yeah, let's start September 11th. And I, and, I, and I think that it's also, uh, it doesn't matter if, you, if you're not an artist, if you don't sing. I mean, like I was first like, wait a minute, this pings me, but I'm not an artist. I, I, I don't write books. I mean, I have not published yet. I'm writing it, but it's not published yet. Oh. And, 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 uh, yeah, yeah. And it, those are pinging also. And uh, like, there's a lot of things just pinging, but who, for whom is this for? For whom is this for? Can you tell us more a little bit? I think, I don't know if you mentioned about that. Can you tell us? For who? For everybody. Yeah. Yes. Like, yes. Niche is like, for everybody because if you are young you can join if you're old you can join if you're female you can join if you're male you can join like as i said in the beginning everybody is creative yes the, the point of view we have that we are not yeah. creative stops the creativity every time we have a point of view every time we have a judgment about what we can do and we can't do it stops our abilities and capacities so if you want to discover some of those abilities and capacity that you maybe don't even know of yet maybe this is the right program for you too it's like yeah. everybody can join everybody can have fun and everybody can take something out for them even if they just sit around for an hour and be be like when uh, do you ever take time for being this artist just be it just be like i'm an artist wow yeah, to oh, connect with that, <laughs> yeah, and it connect with that part of you, having a date with that part of you. Yes, yeah. Yes. yeah. Oh, I'm so looking forward. Yeah. So I hope uh, for everybody's watching right now that we can see you in uh, during our dates. <laughs> <laughs> and if you have any question, you can pin Melika in German or in English. You can ask me also about it because I'm with with Melika. It was like almost, like every day we're like chatting about this. So yeah, how can this series contribute to you, to your life, and your being, and and everything for now in the future? And I always said if it makes you wanna you know, pee in your pants, then go for it. <laughs> Love it. Thank you so much, Sylvia. Thank, Thank you for watching and maybe see you at the 11th of September for the 21 date. Yay! <laughs>